asked assistant coach Chris Quinn about those looks. He said they were quality looks, but we obviously would have preferred to attack the paint than spray out to shooters. He said defensively, Brunson is a handful. We got to take care of what he called the easy relief transition buckets. All right, Jared, love the drive, the fade, bottom. He believes Barrett has played during this postseason. He sees the growth. Vincent to the cup, gets the roll. Beautiful move. And his experience to play in tough situations, two national championship games that he's won. Struess mm. hits it, and he looks to the heavens <laughs> after the three. In the game four loss on Monday night. Butler gives it up for Martin. We have even five minutes to play in the third. The bottom has dropped out on the Miami Heat. Lowry for Struess. In, out, and in on a three ball. To get that turnover. And that's 12 turnovers for the Knicks. Butler, two defenders in the area. Grimes trying to stick with him. Adebayo camps out and hits it from the outside. Robinson limping a bit as Tom Thibodeau will take a timeout. They've made in this postseason against Milwaukee in the first round. They knocked out the number one seed in five games and here against the Knicks. This is game five with the Heat in front, three games to one. Outside, Martin got a three. And because Rando had to jump 20 points for Barrett, 28 for Brunson, and 21 for Rando, the Knicks are up to 47% shooting. Martin, he got sandwiched and he still scores in a foul. Wow, Martin able to operate. Rando, knock away by Lowry. 45 seconds to go on the third. Robinson, one dribble and a J. Book it, it's a three. Wow. Eight seconds to go, third quarter. High screen, Zeller. Lowry uses it. Drives all the way. Kick it out. Martin a three. Book it. Caleb Martin with a downtown hit. Toppin gave the Knicks some quality minutes in the first half. And he's out on the floor as well. 84-74. Knicks in front. Miami has Butler, Lowry, Martin, Zeller, and Robinson. Lowry hangs and hits. Plus one. Kyle Lowry can cut it to seven at the free throw line. 16 fast break points. They were averaging less than nine per game in this series. This is more like the Cleveland series where they average 15.6 per game. Great point. In transition, Jalen's got 30 points. So Brunson, the high man once again. Inside, uncontested flush for Zeller. Brunson's got 32. The lead is 13. Lowry, bullet feed. Martin keeps the ball moving. Thibodeau wanted to travel. It's out of bio. Kick. Other corner. Robinson, a rainbow triple right in front of the Knicks bench. Ten to shoot. Hart loses the ball, loses his footing, and Miami is running. Two on two developing. Now a third player joins. Robinson, kick. Lowry, fake on a three. Robinson puts it on the deck. Working around the perimeter. Lowry buries the triple. Stephon Marbury, 2004. Turnover, Grimes. Butler, kick out for Lowry. Seven point lead for the Knicks. Just over eight minutes to play in the fourth. Butler one on one with Grimes. Robinson extends out on Lowry. Butler, the dribble drive. Probing, kick. Lowry shows it, tosses it up, and in. It's a three. Barrett recovers defensively, trying to deal with Lowry. Eight to shoot. Lowry forced to give it up. Adebayo makes his move. Gets to his spot, but comes up short. Taps it over to his teammate, Butler. Duncan Robinson connects. It's a triple. The 12 to shoot. And Hardenstein has come to the scorer's table to replace Robinson. Adebayo makes his move. Fakes. High off the window. And the Knicks lead by seven. Butler, outside. Martin, drive and kick. Robinson a three. He buries it. Duncan Robinson has shot the heat back into the game. 102 to 96. 37 for Jalen Brunson. We hit the four-minute mark of the fourth quarter. Butler takes it in, shovels it up, and good. 
Hartenstein came over, and Jimmy Butler was undeterred. And then you turn the page and deal with game six. But first, deal with this. Win the quarter, win the half, win the night. Butler cans it out of the timeout. Brunson right now has one defender. They set a second defender the last time he touched it. Grimes will set the screen. Switch, Brunson. Oh, what a skip pass. Blocked by Butler. Along that sideline and out of bounds. Well, defensive winning plays. Jimmy Butler, long closeout. Gets on the outside arm. Get a chance to tie this thing up or get down one. We're down to 238 remaining. Butler is fouled by Brunson. Both players on their back. So he's able to conserve that energy and still be fresh enough down the stretch of the game despite playing all those minutes. But then defensively, we've seen that they can get stops. More importantly, can get defensive rebounds. Barrett taking a lot of time. And it no. is a five-second yeah. call. That's when you have to make your decision. Miami very much alive. A minute 12 to go here in regulation. 107-101 Knicks. Lowry with seven to shoot, using the Adebayo screen. The roll, slam! Big finish for Bam Adebayo. With this pressure coming from Miami. You make a mistake, Miami is going to make you play. I love the call with this middle pick and roll. With Bam out of bio. 45 seconds left. 109 103. Knicks. Robinson off the double. Out of bio. Look for the open man. Lowry. Jumper. It's a three. Off the rim. No. Grimes hits the deck. Butler trying to grab the ball. And it's a tie up. The Knicks get it initially. Knocked around to Miami. And Lowry almost turns it over on that pass. Butler hits the deck. And a lot of contact. Oh, a foul is called. Let's see at the end of the play. Kyle Lowry is trying to get a timeout. Jimmy doesn't have possession yet. Oh, that's a foul right there. When Brunson pulls Jimmy Butler back before he, he puts his head, he yanks him right there. That's where he calls the foul. You don't see it from the backside, but from the front right here. Right, that's the foul. A little bit. Can they get the stop in the defensive rebound? Trigger in. Lowry gets a clean look. Can't hit the three. Robinson the box out. And a quick foul. Dagger for New York. Adebayo a three. Clanks off the glass. Rebounded by Brunson. 112 to 103.